some sisters are reciting the Quran on uh, YouTube by openly not the hijab is a lot assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh alhamdulillah something very uh, brilliant thing that the sisters are being reciting a Quran and they memorize the Quran <clears throat> but the reciting the Quran openly in a public not except in the middle of a woman and that is with the niqab because uh, because this is also uh, something like a cunning uh, deception of a shaitan that uh, that would go to a sister the shaitan will go to a sister and whisper in her heart that you memorize the quran now listen this is something very important the sister is a quran memorizer shaitan would come in her heart shaitan will tell her you are a Quran reciter and you're going to be become a very inspiration for other people. So make your recitation on the YouTube and show the world. Now let's go back to the commandment of the Quran. The Quran said a woman should stay in the veil. So this is how the shaitan is deceiving. She's a Quran memorizer. But she has an open page where the shaitan has been deceiving her, telling her that, okay, you go into the public or you go put your videos on the YouTube and people get it inspired and they will memorize the Quran and you will get the reward for that. So this is like a mis this is like a deceiving of a shaitan because the Quran said a woman should stay in the nikah. Now the second example, in one of the hadith, the Prophet Sallallahu said, uh, one of the women was trying to uh, do some type of an agreement with the Prophet and she followed her hand uh, to get a bath with her like an agreement, some type of agreement and then the Prophet uh, screamed and asked Aisha radiallahu as this woman to keep her hand away from me because I do not even like to see a hand of a woman. So this, these are the best examples. So number one, the Quran said the woman should stay in a whale. Number second example, the Quran didn't, the Quran didn't permit that. The Prophet ﷺ didn't permit that. Now those sisters who are in the deception of a shaitan whisper by putting the videos on the YouTube. Now let's look at the example of the Prophet ﷺ. He said, I do not even like to see the woman's hand. Now those women who are reciting a knot and those women are having a full makeup and standing uh, before the public and the men are watching them and on the YouTube there's a millions of people are watching the sister the Quran said this is forbidden the Prophet said this is forbidden so who are these sisters are following they are following shaitan and this is deception of a shaitan in the name of a Quran so how does the shaitan deceiving the sister? shaitan is deceiving the sisters in the name of Quran okay so you recite the Quran and uh, so many sisters and brothers are going to watch you on the YouTube and you become like very great inspiration. But rather you do not get inspiration. But they are, but the shaitan is deceiving them because there's a millions of eyes watching you. Now go back to the Quran. The Quran says the woman should stay in a niqab or the hijab. And the second example, the Prophet said, say, I do not even want to see a woman's hand. So these are the good examples that the woman should stay in a hijab, should not be openly. If she wants to recite the Quran on her YouTube, she has to be fully covered, except a very little part of the eye should be visible and giving a beautiful message to the public where she's reciting a Quran or talking about the Islam, calling to Muslims or the non-Muslims to Islam. That is an appropriate way to do that. But open putting up your open face in the YouTube there's millions of people watching there reciting a not though these things are contradicting Quran and the Sunnah this is not something from the Islam they have their own justifying themselves that the shaitan is whispering the how to do this so people are getting inspired but rather they're getting sin they are also making other people to sin by watching the sisters